take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. What are the symptoms of sudden cardiac arrest? Warning signs and symptoms can appear up to two weeks before cardiac arrest takes place. Chest pain is most commonly reported by men, while women commonly report shortness of breath. You may also experience unexplained fainting or dizziness, fatigue or a racing heart. Let's help you make your mark. The first sign of sudden cardiac arrest may be loss of consciousness, fainting, and or no heartbeat or pulse. Some individuals may have a racing heartbeat, dizziness, chest pain and shortness of breath, nausea or vomiting before a sudden cardiac arrest occurs. Many individuals have no signs whatsoever and simply Let's help you make your mark. Yes, sudden cardiac arrest can happen to an apparently healthy person, but it's not common, says Dr. Zemetbaum. Some don't realize they're at risk for heart disease, and a heart attack may be the first sign. Make your mark, take our lead. Men are more likely than women to have SCA. Some studies show that blacks, particularly those with underlying conditions such as diabetes, high blood pressure, heart failure, and chronic kidney disease or certain cardiac findings on tests such as an electrocardiogram, have a higher risk for SCA. Let's help you make your mark. Cardiac arrest is a devastating event. Despite improving resuscitation practices, mortality for those who suffer an out-of-hospital cardiac arrest OHCA, is greater than 90% with many survivors being left with severe neurological impairment. However, some do make a good recovery and return home to a meaningful quality of life. Take our lead. Five simple ways to prevent a cardiac arrest. Eat a heart-healthy diet that is full of your favorite fruits and vegetables instead. Take 15 to 20 minutes a day to exercise. A brisk walk or bike ride are great ways to enjoy the fresh air while keeping your heart healthy. Take our lead. Stress causes an increase in blood pressure, inflammation, and even cholesterol levels, all of which increases the likelihood of a heart attack, and, subsequently, sudden cardiac arrest. Dr. Michael Galchi, a cardiologist with Manhattan Cardiovascular Associates, told Healthline. Take our lead. If not treated immediately, sudden cardiac arrest can lead to death. Survival is possible with fast, appropriate medical care. Cardiopulmonary resuscitation CPR, using a defibrillator, or even just giving compressions to the chest, can improve the chances of survival until emergency workers arrive. Take our lead. Most cardiac arrests occur when a diseased heart's electrical system malfunctions. This malfunction causes an abnormal heart rhythm such as ventricular tachycardia or ventricular fibrillation. Some cardiac arrests are also caused by extreme slowing of the heart's rhythm, bradycardia. Let's help you make your mark. One year after hospital discharge, 24.5% of patients, regardless of age, had died. 
Survival was 18.5% at 7 years in those 70 years or older, compared with 45.4% in those aged 18 to 69 years. Heart rhythm at the time of arrest strongly influenced long-term survival. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.